Hello out there in YouTube land, it's Mr. Pete Tubal Kane with a special guest this morning. What's your name, sir? Henry. And what's your relation to me? You're my grandpa. Yeah. Or you're my grandson, right? Yeah. All right, what are we going to do today? We've never done a video before. This is a collaboration, and I have to pay him. He's, he's on the payroll. He won't do anything for nothing. He, he's an entrepreneur, a capitalist. Yep. So, uh, what are we going to do? We're going to make a casting out of aluminum. And what will the casting be? It's going to be an H. Yeah, for, what's the H stand for? Henry. Henry. So, we're going to use uh, the foundry process. Of sand. We're going to ram up. Henry's going to ram up a sand mold. I made the pattern last week. And uh, I think we're going to have fun with this. And I hope you enjoy it. And if you do, Leave a comment. Tell them to leave a comment. You leave a comment. <laughs> this will be fun. Yep. All right. Let's get started. Mm -hmm. Okay, now we're at the molding bench filled with Petrobon sand, and Henry has the flasks and all the tools that he needs. What are you going to do first, Henry? Go ahead and start. I'm going to flip this over. What's that called? Flask. A flask. And turn it around so the green faces you. That's right. And now he's going to put the pattern in there. And how are you going to position it? Right in the middle. Yep, I think we need to move it up a little bit because we have to make room for the gate mm -hmm. and the sprue. All right. Put some baking powder on it. That's perfect. And now the riddle. Oh, yep. It's a sieve, but the official name in the foundry world is riddle. And the sand in the muller is all conditioned and ready to go. Ate about two spoonfuls in there. That's enough. That's enough, Henry. No, it's not. <laughs> no, it's not. His first mold, and he's an expert. Because we did a rehearsal. Oh, he just gave a secret away. <laughs> yes, we did a rehearsal yesterday. <laughs> mm. I think that's good enough, don't you? Yeah. He's going to dump the rest in. Perfect. Fill it up, heaping full. You know, many people think that Henry's an American, but actually he was born in Pakistan, so pack that sand. Turn around. Use your heels. So he's from Pakistan. <laughs> Is the sand cold? No, not really. Not too bad? Nope. Okay, I think that's pretty compact. All right, strike it again, Henry. Faster. Time is money. I know, okay? <laughs> One more time. Wow, that's good. We're half done. We are officially half done. Upside down. Luckily the pattern did not fall out. 
this next to Frank? Yep, and match up the colors. Well, Henry's got the colors backwards, but we don't care as long as it, we remember that. Yeah, it's fine. Okay, at this point, before Henry does the second half, we have to determine where the sprue is going to be. And that's why we move the pattern a little bit that way. So we will just remember that this is where it's going to go. Go ahead, Henry. Put a little parting sand on. Be more generous. That's perfect. <coughs> oh, you overdid it now. Looks like liquid nitrogen. When I was teaching, we had to mark the moles because there might have been 10 in a row. So, in this case, there it is, Henry. Not like there's any others, but now we have to cut a hole, Henry. How's the metal going to get in there? We have to cut a hole. That's called the sprue, and does that look like the right spot? Yeah. And I'm, I'm going to use my, my thumb as a depth gauge. And there it is, and then we like to take a... Spin. Let the camera see you get off to the side a little bit. Okay, like this. Now, pat that down real good with your fingers. That's perfect, Henry. Okay. Blow on it. <laughs> good. Henry's not quite strong enough for the next operation, so I'm going to take it apart and we're going to pull the pattern out and cut the gate. So I like to tap it all the way around like that. And then I'm going to lift it up. And there it is. So the next thing we're going to do, yeah, blow it off a little bit, Henry. Use your lungs. Good. Now we've got to cut the gate. Okay, Henry, let's cut the gate between the sprue and the H. That's right. All right, blow it off. Where's the bellows? Are we deep enough? Yeah. Maybe not. Okay. Next, we have to withdraw the pattern. Okay, we put a screw into the walnut. By the way, this is walnut. All right, lift it straight up, Henry. Wow, he didn't waste any time, did he? All right, blow it with your lungs. No, we got to get this out here first. Blow it with your lung, your your young lungs. Hold on. Henry doesn't smoke yet. And I never will. Oh no, you need to start smoking when you're 18. Camels, that's good for your lungs. I'm going to reassemble the mold. Remember, this is the cope, this is the drag. Now, Henry put the colors together backwards, so I got to make sure I reassemble it backwards. You think that's a minor problem? Imagine teaching freshmen this. How many were totally backwards? Half of them. That finger's backwards, too. I wish I could straighten it. <laughs> hey, I have a bent middle finger. Okay. That mold is ready to pour. Henry, take a bow. Take a bow. There you go. 
<laughs> Hello again, Shadow Man here. Now notice that when I'm back lit, I am a silhouette. Not a shadow, I'm a silhouette. And you know, a lot of people like to shoot their entire videos backlit like this, so you can't see anything. Okay, Henry went in the house to wash his feet, and he thought I would wash his feet. Well, he was wrong on that. And uh, I've already got the furnace loaded with 10 pounds of aluminum, even though I only need 3 ounces. And I'll fire that up, and it's going to take about 15 minutes, and then I will do the pouring. I think that's a little too risky for Henry. And then we will break the mold open, and... Uh, Maybe in another video I'll have him file it and sand it and we'll put it back on it and paint it and he can hang it up in his room and remember his old grandpa. Holy mackerel, that didn't take much, did it? Nope. Went into some of the sand. Went into some of that sand down there. Are you ready to open it up, Henry? Yeah. Now remember, it's hot. Be careful. Go ahead and take it apart. It's going to be heavy. Lift her up. That's right. It's hard to do it with the gloves. And up, yeah, upside down right there. That's right. Real hard. Oh, I see what's the matter. Yeah, I know what we'll do. We're going to let it drop out the bottom. Like that. Yeah, hot now. I'll put it right here. Now let's right hold it in front of the camera right here. And look. From a wooden pattern, we made an H. Now in the next video, if we do one, we'll saw that off, and we'll file all the flashing off, and we'll paint it. Would that be awesome? Yeah. Did you learn something today, Henry? Yeah. Was it fun? Yeah. Good. Say so long for now. So long for now. Well, Henry, you did an admirable job, from a wooden pattern to a metal H for Henry. So long for now.